Look, it's in there. What is it? Where'd it go? It's all right. It's all right. It's all right. This is the first time that I've gotten him to play while I'm in here. Yes, look. Yes, we got out our bucket of toys, and he does keep checking to see if there's a clear path to um, the carrier. He's like, no, but he has only made it, he's run back to the carrier a couple times, but he has not gone inside it um, at all since I've gotten here. Here, let's move. This, yes. Oh goodness. Um, and that was only because the the plastic was rattling a whole bunch, and it freaked him out. Look at Roxy. Roxy wants in here so bad. I know. I think tomorrow I'm gonna see. He, um, he still growls at through the screen. So I don't know. I don't know. I know. Everyone should love you, Roxy. Yes, I know. It's okay. Where'd your ball go? Here you go. There you go. Where's the Frank? Oh, it went back in. Oh. Once the toys go in the igloo. They're gone. I came in and I could tell he'd been playing because all of the, those little toys were inside the igloo. <laughs> but he can't figure out how to get them out. So, once they're in there, they're in there. It's alright. I'm not going to hurt you. I don't know what's happening out there. Oh, hello. I know. Hi. Hi, little bug. Oh, I have to paint these. I have to repaint this whole place. When I repainted out there, I didn't do the closet. And I should have. But I got tired. There you go. I have to paint the doors anyway. He's doing so good. Look, Luna is very interested. What is it? What you doing, Luna? I may actually have to go get second dinner because this is actually bedtime. And I normally, I put out a ton of food before I go to bed. A ton of wet food. And look, they've eaten half of it already. That's supposed to last, y'all. It's so funny because some days, or some mornings I'll come in and there still be a little food on the plate. And then some mornings I'll come in and it has been like licked clean. You just never can tell with kittens. 
Yeah, okay, say good night. Say good night. Miss Luna, say good night. Hey, Mr. Zen. Say good night. Say good night. Oh, here comes Roxy. Hi, Roxy. Hi, Mom. What is it? What is it? What is this mess? <laughs> she, I know. I hear you. I'm telling everybody. I know people have been asking about you and I keep forgetting to update. Come on, over here. Let's fix some of your toys. This one plays like a banshee. Yes, I know. Tell everyone. Okay, she did. Um, Rainbow, we went to the vet and we had ultrasound. Didn't we? Yes, we did. Um, the vet was pretty positive she like this feeling of her that she wasn't pregnant but we wanted to make sure she didn't have like fluid built up in her abdomen or anything like that yes but he said like her mammary glands and stuff like that weren't um active or swollen hi swollen but we went ahead with the ultrasound like i said to see if there wasn't fluid and it all came i forgot to take my scarf off before i came in here everything came back negative yes now they did take some blood um to test like a thyroid and something oh i can't remember thyroid function and something else just to make sure but um we think she's just i mean look at this this was on here over here and that was over there oh i know i leave you for a couple hours and you go insane uh but she is fine she is really good come here come here and um, she does have a bit of a cold, a kitty cold. Um, we're not doing anything for it at the moment. We're just going to watch her for a couple days to see if it clears up. And then um, if everything's okay and it clears up, then I'm going to integrate her into the nursery. And we're going to start looking for a forever family because she is big enough and she is happy enough. She's very social. Um, she's had several visitors. You've got something right there. Um, to be adopted. There, come here. Come play with your thing. Um, she's very good. Yeah, but I did want to give everybody an update because I know they were wondering. Everybody's wondering, and it's been a minute since she's had one because this week I have not filmed a whole bunch because it's been crazy, crazy. Yes, I'm really hoping everything calms down um, by the end of this weekend. And next week, oh, I can kind of go back to a semblance of normal. Yeah. Okay, here. Look, show everybody your pretty face and say bye. Oh, that's a pretty face. That was not a very good shot of your pretty face, but okay. Yeah. Janet sent us over some food and supplies. Uh, it says, Ooh, enjoy your gift from Janet Stemper. And it actually came, I know I'm really working on keeping up with everything. Um, it did come several days ago. <laughs> uh, but we have been busy, busy around here. So that's why that's open. But she sent two of the Fancy Feast Delights, um, which are favorites around here, as you can see. And then she sent um, two of the tree trunks, which have turned out to be amazing. Um, I use them all the time. I use them everywhere. And it is about to be kitten season, because here in the south it starts really early. And they are going to be perfect. Um, and they also, they clean really well. I was kind of worried, because they're made out of something weird. But they do. They clean very well. And then... She sent over a measuring cup, um, which I use these quite, quite a bit, but I've never seen one like this. It's where you can tell the measurement from looking from up here, you know, so there's no like squatting down and um, trying to read where the liquid is, which I found very intriguing. Um, it does not take much to impress me, obviously, <laughs> but I, I'm very excited about that uh, because I use these all the time um especially when i'm bottle feeding and things like that and then she sent over a quad dewormer i just found these 
And everyone, don't freak out because it says puppies and small dogs. But these three medications um, are the same dosage uh, in cats and dogs. Um, this first medicine is for tapeworms, um, both types of tapeworms. The second medicine is for roundworms. And then this one is for um, tapeworms as well. But it also treats several other bacterias. Um, with a long enough treatment, it treats Giardia. It treats several um, bacteria I cannot uh, pronounce. So that's what those are for. And all three are the same dose for cats and dogs. So I was very excited uh, to find this. And then, and I don't know how she knows, or maybe she just guessed. I don't know, but she sent me over a pack of G2s, which is my very, very favorite um, pen. I love the fine and the medium and um, the color. I use, like, all the pens I use on most are G2s. So I thought that was kind of funny. Um, and I have already opened it because <laughs> I was so excited. Um, so thank you, Janet, very much for always thinking of us. Also, thank you for your monthly donation. I did receive that as well and have not been as up on my emails as I should have, uh, but I will get there. So thank you very much, Janet. Oh, hi, Shira. Shira like darted over just as I hit play. Oh, hi, hi. Are you going to say hi? Yeah. Um, the lovely Sharon and Sunday sent us some food. Yeah, can you read that for us? No? Okay, and then Chica's over here. Hi, community. Enjoy your gift from Sharon and Sunday. Can you say thank you? Yeah, because this is actually your one of your favorites, huh? She really likes um, the uh, white fish, the fishy and cheddar one. she honey, I can't show anybody anything. All right, well, we'll just have to work around the big floof meister. Yes, um, they sent over a case of the poultry and beef pate, a case of the delights with cheddar, which um, it contains whitefish, turkey, and chicken. Oh, baby. You never want to be on camera. What's the deal? What's the deal? She has been very loving lately. I think it's because it's cooled off. She much prefers the fall and winter to summer and spring. Okay, and then she also sent over a case of the Fancy Feast Seafood Grilled, which I was out of. So, that's why that's already opened. Yeah. Okay, can you tell... Sharon and Sunday, thank you. We thank you. She's a nut. Thank you, Sharon. Oh, you gonna make it smell like you? Okay. Okay. She gets just like, do I get some? What? What? Laura Prestridge sent us over some gifts and supplies. Sarah, baby girl. What you doing? I can't film when you sat on everything. I know. I love you. I know her's a good girl. Okay, Laura sent us a pack of the Arm & Hammer um, washing tablets. So excited. I do laundry constantly. You can probably hear the dryer in the background. It's ridiculous. And it's only going to get worse with kitten season. And then she sent two cases of Fancy Feast. One um, of the classic pate. She was trying to um, snuggle with the camera. And one of the poultry and beef grilled. Uh, as you can see, I've opened. I have had them a couple days. <laughs> she cracks me up. Um, and she sent over a thing of the disinfecting wipes, which I love. I need to use. Um, I had to use one, and that's why it is open. I was out, 
which shock it shocks me every time I'm out of something you'd think I would never run out but I do and then she sent two bags two bags of the yesterday's news um, non-clumping recycled kitten litter which uh, I really love I will tell you it always I always think it sounds funny when I say recycled kitten litter because that just sounds gross <laughs> it's from recycled newspaper but just when I say it because I it just sounds like you know, and never mind it doesn't matter um, it's already been quite a long morning so I am rambling and then and these are just precious she sent over a pack of fashion boutique socks that have little kittens on them look and I laid them out so you could see all the cute kittens I think I think this one is my favorite it's either this one I don't know it's just like with real cats and kittens I have a new favorite every day but are they not precious? They are precious. So thank you, Lisa. Uh, she or thanks you. See, this is why right here, I take all the bags of not only litter, but food, and they go in containers because she's not the only one that does it. There's a lot. They'll rip open. They love these bags and I let them sit on them. Like after I've opened them and taken everything out, they love to use them to like sit on. But if I just left this on the floor, it would be everywhere, wouldn't it, Shira? Anyway, thank you, Lisa, so, so much. 